Is this, but for real though, this is the start of the interview, yeah. right? And that's, yeah. there we go. Behind the scenes, Dan Joseph's awesome. There is very much an art to wrestling. And some people, I'm sure it comes naturally and it just clicks and they like, okay, I know and I'm listening and I hear and I understand. It took a little while longer for me, for sure. Growing up, I you know played hockey forever. I, I used to play defense. So I'm eyeballing, I'm looking around, and somebody's looking behind them to catch a pass, and I'm just charging, lowering that shoulder and hitting them. Uh, after high school, I did a lot of bar league hockey and a lot of, a lot of things like that. But I missed that physicality, especially. I wanted something that was like, you know, real, I could feel that. I could lay that shoulder into somebody or, you know, pick them up and throw them. And wrestling, that's exactly it. Nice suplex there by the champion, there you go. When I showed up to the first taping I'd ever gone to, um, I had been training for about six months or so. I, I did a bunch, bunch of practice matches, you know, you work on this and that, and uh, none of them were very good yet. But I looked physical, like I could move, I could move, I could, you know, get beat up. Hey, who can't get beat up? I could get beat up. So I showed up and my debut match was against James Morgan. I had nice purple and black tights on. I had borrowed kick pads. I got beat to hell in a few minutes. That is skill. Morgan is just destroyed. Who is this kid anyway? I thought we did decent in pack three. I thought we had a pretty good run. Um, and I thought we were pretty entertaining. I mean, if we're being really real about it, that was a spectacle. That was a coach and a water boy, and Dylan, he very much knew what he was doing, and I was along for the ride, and I was learning very much so at that point. But I, I didn't feel very confident in my in-ring ability at the time. Oh, tried to plant Yuma, but oh no, it turned off! Sex Factor! Sex Factor center of the ring! Three weeks, a month after we won the titles, I got injured, hurt my knee, boom, at the gym. I jumped about an inch, blew my knee out. Terrible, terrible. Took forever to get back. Finally, I get back to wrestling. I start working again. I'm going, few matches. I'm like three matches in, I get a hernia. Are you kidding me? I'm just getting back into this. I have a hernia. Another surgery, and then I get a call from Dave, Dave Marquez. He gave me a call one day and said, You want to try announcing? And yes, you know, I had been injured. I was trying to get back. I wanted to stay active and, you know, current, and I guess. He liked the way I communicated, so he gave it a shot. Started talking. Anything can happen. I might enter. I might win the Rumble tonight. Joe might win it. You don't know. And now, I'm watching the match, and I'm seeing it live. I'm seeing what everybody does, how it looks, how the fans react, what the people, and, you know, what the producers are saying in my ear. And then, I go home, and, you know, a week later, I watch it again. It just helps me, like, okay, so don't do that anymore. Do that. Be more like this, don't be like that. And it, I feel like a different wrestler from my time announcing more so than, you know, more so of a change than any other point. Stand up, man. Stand up, man. Winning the title was, it was awesome out there. The crowd's energy, you know, you feel all that excitement. You've just been throwing and duking it out, you know, for 15 minutes or whatever. And it's, then it's over and you're holding that. And it's, it's nice, you know, it's, it's, it, it's awesome. Like, I felt like I really earned that spot, you know, over the years and years that I had been there and, and getting it, winning the championship was, was like, it was, it was, it was great. It was a very real reaction. Shane, I got it! Shane! Shane, I got it, baby! Shane, I got it, baby! Just holding that, knowing how far I've come from getting squashed to this moment, you know, in my home promotion where I started, you know, literally on TV with them, it's... It's very, very nice, and I would like to hold on to that for as long as I can.